What's going on? Welcome back to the show. It's Speakers Lab. The gang is back. You guys know what it is. And look, man, the entire team is back here for a video that I've been wanting to do for a couple of days now, but I just couldn't find the right words, man. I just couldn't find the right words. Like, you guys know when you got to say something or do something kind of important to you, whether it's a good thing or a bad thing, like sometimes you just can't find the right words to say. So guys, I'm going to take a deep breath. <laughs> I'm going to say this in the best way I know how. Look, if you guys know me, you probably know I got a lot of pets. Hi guys. Look, I got two bunnies and I got two cats now. Well, that's a three, but I got two bunnies and I got two cats and I love my pets. But it all started with years ago with a bunny named Lulu. <sighs> it's a long story that I've told a million times. I never wanted a pet. I didn't even ask to get a bunny, right? It just, it's this weird, crazy story that made it feel like I was meant to get this bunny named Lulu. And it changed my life. I know it sounds corny, but like it changed my life, right? Let's start over though, because the reason I'm talking about this right now, guys, two days ago was the five year anniversary of Lulu's first video. And I so badly wanted to like make a post about it, make a video about it, talk about it, but I couldn't find the right words to say. So all I want to see right now, guys, this one's for you, Lulu. We're going to dedicate this one to Lulu and we're going to do something that you guys suggested. And dude, I love this idea. I love it. Yo, I know this is just wishful thinking, but I wish uh, Paya had met Lulu. They probably wouldn't have gotten along. They probably would have fought over who loves Melly the most because Melly's just a hopeless romantic. He really is. All right, guys, so we got to do two things today. First of all, the Lulu Bear Army. And by the way, guys, this is kind of a normal hybrid army. That's what we love. We switch it around a little bit, but the one thing that never changes is the name Lulu Bear. Look, if you guys like that army, if you have that in your quick train and you want to name it Lulu Bear, guys, I would be honored from the bottom of my trolley heart. <laughs> I, I, I would love that. Also, guys, we got to do a trolley upgrade today because obviously, and I don't think I got one in mind, but first let's bust out the army. Here we go. Yo. This is a sick base. I mean, we don't need the gold, but we definitely need the other stuff. Hey, did I show you guys? We now have the gold coin plushie. This is like legit Supercell merch. And we got the Dark Elixir drop. I love these, dude. We got to find something to do with them. I mean, they're keychains, kind of, but they're way too big. Like, what are you going to stick this in your pocket? It's going to look a little weird. I mean, I can try. Ah, uh, yeah, it looks a little weird. Okay, guys, do you want to take this? This is what we're going to do. You know what? I'm going to search one more time and try to find a more trolley base. Hang on. Guys, we can't even take... Well, okay, okay. Wait, wait, wait. Let me hit boost hero, boost army. We don't have pets, but otherwise, we do have pretty good stuff here. Guys, this is what I'm getting so sick of on our main base. There's just nothing new. Like, this is the point we're at on my main base, right? And so there's not that much new. There's nothing new. And there's not much left to do. It made me think we got to get on our other bases. We, we got to get on this one. I'm way more happy over here. And after today, I'm going to be even more happy here because I don't know if I said this earlier, but this is kind of what I meant to say. This is the base that me and Lulu built together. And that means a lot to me. Um, I know that sounds... Oh, come on, dude. You got to get in. What are you doing? I didn't even get the rage spell in the right spot. That's the problem here. Okay. Okay. Step up. Step up. This is going to be such a weird queen walk. I mean, we're still in it. We're getting the inferno. Okay. Uh, I'm hoping we can get the queen without too much issue i guess we are about to see okay poison dude i think we might be good all right well we got to get going here we go oh she's gonna go down right oh, i'll try i'll try to keep her up i'll try to keep her up my final raid spell dude she's doing it she's doing it okay so king you're yeah you're done dude you're done just do your thing okay let's get you in there let's get that siege couple of you guys and the rest, while you're going in the middle. Here we go. Dang, dude, look, this is such a mess. I have no more. Oh, the queen went down. I have no more rage spells, but I mean, I guess it's not the end of the world. We'll, we'll probably be fine. Let me hit the ward ability. Oh man, I love doing this. Dude, look at those tombstones perfectly right there. Was that from us? Wait a minute, wait a minute, guys. I gotta put this back in perspective. For a second, I was like, 
why is this not going better? I mean, it wasn't the best raid ever, but honestly, guys, this was a Town Hall 14. We aren't Town Hall 14, we're Town Hall 13. I mean, we're, we're solid, but we're not max even. This was sick. <laughs> this was... Guys, what did we just get? Are you kidding? Guys, the main event today is the thing that I really, ever since I heard one of you guys say it, I knew we should do it. I knew we had to do this. As I said earlier, this is the base that me and Lulu built together. And I, I truly want to memorialize that in some way. Like, I feel like I got back into, you know, playing Clash in this base when Lulu came into my life. And it was at such a weird time in my life. Right after I got Lulu, we started getting some success on YouTube, but I also, you know, got cancer and had to go through this whole scare where I thought, you know, I, I seriously thought something bad was gonna happen to me. I mean, you know what I'm talking about. So throughout all these ups and downs, it feels like we came out on the other side of it, me and Lulu together, and we built this base. We did, you know, what, thousands of videos together. And guys, I really wanna memorialize that here right now. And you know what we gotta do, right? Let me go in here. I promise I'm not gonna cry. Wait, let me take a picture of that. I don't know if I've ever seen that screen. Well, I guess I actually changed the name on this base once. This is so funny, dude. Oh my goodness, I just realized, guys, I initially named this base after my mom. Then I changed it to Beaker's Lab. Now I'm changing it back to another person who's a big, you know, influence in my life. Well, a bunny, Lulu. Let's do it up. Boom. You guys know what we're gonna do? I like that. It's always been Lulu's lab. Just as much as it was Beaker's lab. I think I'm ready to do this thing. Did I get a picture of this? I think so. All right, done. Re-enter your new name, huh? Whoa. Oh, that looks so sick in the middle there. All right, let's do it up, guys. There's a third confirmed thing? I actually like this. Wait a minute, let me get a picture of it in the middle. Hey guys, before we hit this, I just want to show you something. I hope this doesn't make any of you sad. Do you guys remember this? Okay, so when we were leaving uh, my, the old apartment that I lived in for the bulk of our YouTube career, right? Before I bought this house, uh, I, I wrote this and I put it on the wall and I was just going to leave it there. And then at the last second, I went in and <laughs> I, I was like pinned on the wall. And so at the last second, I went in and got it. And I'm so glad I did because... Um, that's it, man. Beacon Lulu, we're here. It's time to go in three, two, one. Yo, Chief Monk over here gonna make me cry. I think that's what it always was. Oh, man. <laughs> All right, guys, look, let's finish this off right. Every 10 seconds, we're going to hit one. In three, two, one. Here we go. Dude, I wish we could put it up here so you guys can see it too. But uh, we can put it on the screen. It's cool. All right, six, seven, eight, nine, dunk. Okay, we got enough builders, right? Yeah, yeah, we're good. <laughs> Imagine getting to this point and being like, nope, don't have enough builders. Seven, eight, nine, ten. This is gonna be good, guys. We gotta get a little bit of gold at the very end. I'll show you guys how we're gonna do that. Seven, eight, nine, ten. We can do this final one here. This is gonna look sick. We're gonna have six giant bombs going at once. Eight, nine, 40. Now we gotta go in here real quick with the medallions. Guys, this base does not have that many medallions, but we always have a couple. Perfect. Seven, eight, nine, Shouts to you, buddy. It's like we got this arrow pointing up to the sky, right? Like, shouts to you, buddy. We love you, buddy. Guys, I think I'm coming to realize that our pets mean more to us than just being a companion animal, right? Which that's the case too, right? Like if you're kind of, you know, if you're, if you're suffering depression or other mental health issues, it can really help immediately having a companion animal. But I think I've realized through having Lulu, 
she sort of represented the time in my life where I went from the worst times of my life to where I am now, which I'm thankful every day. I get to do exactly what I want. And whether that's a coincidence or not, right? Like I'm not saying, you know, Lulu was literally my manager and, <laughs> you know, making decisions for me to get me here. But I got to admit, man, sometimes it felt like that because it was just me and her here. And so I just want to say to you guys, if you've lost a family member, like I just lost my grandma as well. That's why the last year was just so, so tough uh, along with COVID and everything. And so look, if you guys are going through loss, just know, you know, I'm in it too, but it gets better. It really does. You know, some things I can't find the words to say. And sometimes I kick myself for being like, why are you so upset about this? You know, but it's okay. So anyway, guys, in conclusion, leave two for Lulu forever. I should get a tattoo of that. <laughs> I'm going to work on that. My girlfriend's going to get a tattoo uh, pretty soon on my birthday. So I might, um, I might look into that. Just get a, get a prototype drawn up. See what it, see what it could look like. It would be sick. But anyway, guys, for now, leave two for Lulu forever. Three for Melly. That's that guy right there. And four for Paya. She's the other one all the way in the back. We love you guys. And we will see you right here tomorrow on the one and only Beaker's Lab. Oh my God. Actually, guys, tomorrow, dude, there's some big construction going on in my house tomorrow. I don't think we're going to have a video. Ah, I meant to say this earlier in the video. Okay. There's some big construction happening here, which is going to change again, kind of change my life forever for the better. Um, it's a good positive thing. Trust me. We'll talk about it tomorrow or the next day as soon as we can. Anyway, if we don't have a video tomorrow, that is why. But we'll see you right here as soon as we can on Beaker's Lab. Peace.